This weekend has provided quite a bit of rain chances across the area, and we certainly racked up some totals across the region. Looking at weekend rainfall so far, we picked up nine tenths of an inch in Defiance, six tenths of an inch both at the Lima and Finley airports, and 22 hundredths of an inch, inch down at the Van Wert airport in Van Wert County. Today's almanac high temperature was 73 degrees, low this morning was 62, 41 hundredths of an inch today, which brings our monthly total to two. 2.45 inches. Current temperatures right now are pretty cool. 65 in Lima, 65 as well up in Napoleon, and 65 to the west in Van Wert. So rather cool right now. Looking at satellite and radar right now, things are a bit quiet. We do have some clouds across the area. We did have a band of showers that stretch generally from Lima through Logan County over the past couple hours, but those have since dissipated and moved off to the southeast toward Columbus. So right now we're trending toward or drier weather across the region. The weather culprit that was responsible for our rainfall over the weekend was just this low pressure system. That area of low pressure is moving southeastward and will move along the Ohio River and into the mid-Atlantic states and eventually depart and bring a drier trend to the area as we bring in some northerly winds from Canada. All right, so over the weekend, we didn't get as much rainfall as we could have, and that is due to a weather phenomenon called Virga. So I'm going to do a quick little weather lesson on Virga. So in order for rain to occur, rain starts from the cloud and reaches the ground. If the entire atmosphere is saturated from cloud to ground, you're going to get precipitation that reaches from cloud to ground without evaporating. Virga, on the other hand, is when precipitation starts aloft and it starts falling, but it encounters a region of dry air where the dew point temperature and the actual air temperature are further apart from each other, hence the relative humidity is lower. As a result, what happens is the rain evaporates mid-air before reaching the ground, but eventually it will cool the air temperature back to the dew point temperature with time. So even though you may have Virga to start with, it can eventually saturate the col atmospheric column and you could get rain eventually with time. And that's actually what happened over the weekend. We had some rain evaporating across the upper levels of the atmosphere, but when Virga fell, it helped saturate the atmosphere, and that's why we got rain eventually later on. So at Skycast right now, a couple showers are possible for the remainder of the night, but again, a drying trend will continue. Temperatures will start off in the lower 60s for your Monday morning. And as we go through the day on Monday, notice the winds are now out of the northeast. So we'll have cooler northeasterly winds. Expect temperatures to only rise into the upper 70s. A couple of lucky spots may try to hit 80 degrees. But as we go into Tuesday morning, temperatures will drop to right around 60 degrees across the area with northeasterly winds prevailing. And once again, Tuesday will be very similar to our Monday with temperatures in the upper 70s. Can't rule out a spotty shower, but that would be more the exception rather than the rule. Going into tonight, early evening shower possible, the most cloudy, low temperature around 62 degrees. Going into our daytime tomorrow, pretty nice day to start the work week. Mild, partly sunny, can't rule out a spotty shower, high temperature right around 78 degrees. And as we look at your seven-day forecast, Tuesday, extremely similar to Monday, partly cloudy, spotty shower, 78. Wednesday is similar, just a tick warmer at 79. Thursday and Friday, we do manage to climb back into the lower 80s with partly cloudy skies with a spotty shower. Eventually, by next weekend, the humidity will slowly begin to return along with the storm system that will give us chances for showers and storms both Saturday and Sunday with temperatures back in the lower 80s. Sartage.